Hi guys, Vex here. Welcome back to some Herflurf Turf. And today, we are going to be like hmm, the Queen of Blades, Kerrigan, uh, or possibly the Overmind, maybe. Yeah, you know, from StarCraft, the uh, leaders of the Zerg. It started out as being the Overmind, and then uh, later on it switched to uh, Kerrigan. Infested Kerrigan. Ooh, music. Get him! Get him! We got a mounted gun in here. Oh, you know, I actually heard that. They want to get those restrictors back online. Ow! I didn't know that was so close behind me. Hello? Oh yeah, I got him right in the chest. I have your weapon now, suckers! So I was thinking today... I was on YouTube today... Watching one of my favorite channels... Eh, eh I wouldn't say favorite favorite, but uh... I watch this guy a lot. He's uh, His name is Jerry Mitchelluk. And he is a uh, world championship uh, shooter, uh, shooting sports athlete. And I watched him shoot. I watched the clip where he shoots uh, six rounds out of a revolver, reloads, and fires six more rounds. And he does all of this in 2.99 seconds. Uh, and. I was watching the way he reloaded. And he was reloading, I believe, with uh, moon clips. And he kicks the shells out and then just drops in... Uh, I should say cases, excuse me. Shells are for shotguns. Kicks the cases out and then drops in a, a fresh moon clip. And he does it so fast and fluidly. It's almost... Uh, oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, so there's a machine gun nest up ahead. But it was just amazing. And it really, like, if you're highly skilled, uh, the speed with which... 1-1000, one, one thousand, two, one thousand. Uh, Yeah, the speed at which you can reload guns in video games isn't that far off, really, uh, if you're very skilled. Uh, I'm going to make a run for it. Oh, wish me luck! <laughs> sector is not secure here, right? Ah. Hi guys. Um You guys go over there.
Okay, I think I need to literally use my bugs in this area as bait. Oh, I'm gonna make another run for it. Good. Oh crap! was rough. I think we're all right. Looks like this is where I can get in, maybe. Uh, I assume these fortifications are actually leftovers from uh, World War II. All right, let's go this way. Looks like we need to go this way. Well, now those are all new combine fortifications. Probably gonna want to use the shotgun for clearing rooms in here. Oh, they know I'm coming. Oh, they know I'm coming. Oh, my bugs are getting them though. But anyway, yeah, um, it might sound silly to some people, but kind of one of my, um, one of my goals is to get, like, maybe one day be half as good as someone like Jerry Mitchell look at, uh, sport shooting. Like, he is, like, freakishly good, and that man's probably forgotten more about how to handle a revolver than I'll ever learn in my life. Uh, that's how good he is. But um, yeah, it's just one of my one of my mini goals in life. That's that's actually one of them. And uh, maybe I could actually compete and get that good. Uh, I use I use a semi-auto, or maybe do something like a three-gun competition, where you use a uh, handgun, shotgun, and rifle. All in the same competition. Anti Citizen One, that's who I am apparently. Now that might actually get me motivated to post, uh, to show my face on camera as if I was at a competition. And I might post that to my channel. Hmm. I wonder if I can take out that dude right over there. Yep. Get him. I'm kind of surprised how effective the antlions are against the combine. They really don't. Um, like, like at least the combine with the shotguns and the SMGs. Like, I think they'd mow the antlions down before they got to them, but that's just not the case. I'm not sure why it is. It's like they can't uh, can't properly hit them or something. That's a dropship over there. 
Can I kill it with a gun like this? Eh, probably not. Alright. Here you go, guys. Go get him. Get him. <laughs> oh, wow. Does that look familiar? Ah. That looks like the, uh, the pipes on the cliffside from Half-Life 1 where we were at Black Mesa. Like, seriously, it really does. Huh. Back at ya. I've got a gun, too. I feel almost kind of sorry for these Combine Troopers. How they're just like running out into machine gun fire. That's one thing I remember uh, from TV tropes. Is uh, evil virtues. And courage is one of them. I mean, yeah, they're the bad guys. But they're still running out into, you know, they're still charging into machine gun fire and fighting monstrous giant insect things with horrifyingly huge fangs that constantly keep coming. Huh. I guess, am I overly sympathetic to the Combine? Maybe it's just because I don't like, I don't really like hurting people, even even these damn combine. I mean, that's true. I say that as I'm about to pop that guy with a crowbar. Oh, I'm sad that I'm out of 357 ammo. I'm gonna try and make a run for it now. Urgh. Gotcha. Final portion cushion. Dumber, dumber, dumber. Dumber, dumber, dumber. Dumber, dumber, Yeah, this cliffside area looks like the same double pipes that came down from Half Life 1, right? Wasn't it two pipes coming down? Um. Wait, how do I get up there? Oh, I must go this way. Oh, I didn't. Okay, I didn't see this at first. I thought I had to get up. I'm pretty. I know I have to get up there. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Great. Oh God. Oh, by the way, the ant lions, if they fall in water, they die. And they apparently cannot swim at all. Now, this would have made Ravenholm uh, much less scary if I had had an army of killer bugs at my side to kill the, kill the zombies. Now that would be a cool uh, custom campaign. Is bugs versus bugs versus zombies? You do. Uh, you're only armed with um, maybe the gravity gun and then bug bait. What do I push this off or something? Oh right. Oh right. 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 
which are only armed with maybe the gravity gun and then your bug bait. Not even a crowbar, so you've got to... It's more like, um... I guess it'd be a lot more like Pikmin, maybe. Where you have to shepherd your... your followers and get them to kill the zombies for you. Up we go! You know, I almost thought that was a rope at first. But apparently in this game, you cannot climb ropes. Get up there, guys. Up you go. Supplies, motherfucker. Okay! I have to wonder, though. What's up with the random crates, like, tucked into the rocks here? I mean, there was, like, a burned body in there. Are they, is Valve trying to say, like, the, the crates were put there? By the body? Like, guy, and then he died. Get him! Get him! Yeah! Good job, boy. Good job, good boy. Who's a good boy? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. So Valve pulled a dick move right there. Do you guys know? Do you guys see what Valve did? As you're coming up, you turn here, and you'll probably turn your flashlight on, and there's like nothing behind you, and one of those fast zombies just charges you. Uh, they have a tendency to. It's almost. It's uh, honestly at this point, it's predictable. Like, oh, I'm gonna climb up somewhere, and I'm gonna turn a corner into a pipe. Like, any time there's, like, a, a ledge like this, where you could easily fall off, and you approach and then turn the corner in to look in the pipe, there's going to be something that rushes at you really quickly, whether it's a head crab jumping at your face, or if it's a fast zombie charging you. I mean, you guys have recalled, I assume, the people watching now have stuck with me and watched me all the way through Half-Life 1. Um... <laughs> what clusers. But, yeah, I mean, you've seen this again and again. Like, I look in a pipe or something, and... And, up oh, there's the, uh... Something, something rushing at me. I like how, by the way, the Combine, like, sees his buddy go down, and then... And then rushes to the exact same spot where his buddy got killed, so I could kill him, too. Well, maybe that's why they're not scared, is they're too dumb to be scared. Or they've had something done to their brain to, like... Actually, I think that might be true. Um, the Combine are... They do get modified. Like, they have to undergo surgery and stuff. Oh, are you kidding me? I hit the little... I do like how when you run out of ammunition in a weapon, it tries to give you the next best option. Like, you'll notice it gave me the pulse rifle, because that's my next best long-range option. After the um, crossbows run out of ammunition. Actually, I think it would have given me the 357, um, but that was also out of ammunition. So, it uh, went ahead and tried to give me the uh, pulse rifle. That's actually a really minor thing that maybe people wouldn't notice. That, depending on the weapon you had equipped, when you run out of ammunition, it'll try to give you something different. Uh, but I think that's pretty cool. Guess I will use this now. Oh, it's jailbreak time! Now this is, if I remember correctly, this is actually a pretty tough, um... This is a pretty tough area of the game.
Wait. No. 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 Damn it, no. Oh crap, I'm gonna die. No, I need more ammunition. I saw it. I need that right there. Damn it! No! No! Damn it! I'm gonna get it! I'm gonna get you! Yes! Wait, how are you still alive? I need to be in this room right now. This room, right here. This one. Oh, get out of my way! Oh, God. Oh. I thought that was five shots! This gunship is cheating! <laughs> oh, man, that was close. I thought that was really, like, an awesome thing I tried to do right there. There, stay against the wall. Damn it! Ow! There we go. That's what I needed. Right there. How are you not dead? Damn it! Ow! <laughs> there's two- oh god, there's two of them! Really, game? Wait a minute, I just ran off without the- In! Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's two gunships. Two gunships and a machine gun emplacement covering the ammunition. <laughs> Valve is just like, fuck you, player. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Okay. F6. Uh, oh my god, this is, this is rough. Bugs! Bugs, get in, get over there. Oh crap. Oh. Okay, I think I got one of the machine gun emplacements. Now I've discovered that I can't really... Oh no, what the... Ah! No, not you. No, get away from me. Don't attract its attention over here. Go over there and let it shoot at you. <laughs> ah! Two gunships? Like, for real game. One gunship. I've had worse. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Shit! Don't! No! Gunship! Fuck! Die! Damn it! Ah! Loading. Try again. Oh god! <laughs> Ha ha! One more. Yes! Suck it! Ha 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 
Oh god. Oh man. Two gunships at once in a open courtyard with machine gun nests covering it. Like okay. Sure. Why not? Whew. Uh, uh, guys, go out that way. There you go. There we go. There we go. Okay. I was doing okay, and then one of the gunship's bullets nicked the flammable barrel nearby me, and I think it blew up and knocked. It pushed. There were two barrels right here. Now I've discovered that I can't really. Oh no! What the? And I think the first one blew up, and then the one that was beside it, I was over here, I think, and it was pushed along the uh, railing here to get land like right beside me and then blew up right behind me. I think that's what happened, because I was doing good, and then all of a sudden... Um, ooh, hidden health kit, nice. I was doing really well on HP, and then all of a sudden I was down to like nothing. Uh, cause the barrel blew up. Oh man. Okay. <sighs> Whew. Well guys, I think, I think, personally, you should to toss me a like for taking on two gunships and machine gun nests. I, I was trying. That was rough. That was, that was rough. Oh man, so I'm going to take a break and I'll see you guys next episode when we push further into this prison and continue getting shot the hell up by mini combine bullets. Alright. Until next time, as always, <laughs> take it easy.